What's up, everybody? Well, this is Brandon. We're going to play a uh, a game that I've been talking about for a couple of years called Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney. <clears throat> oh, boy. I'm excited. I hate the fact there's an ad at the top of the uh, screen. Well, whatever. I digress. You know, we're we're just gonna, gonna have a good time. Oh no. It's kinda of funny how um <clears throat> in this game you know who the bad guy is. You know they've done it. <clears throat> you just gotta prove them that they did it. So I'm pretty much going to go this pretty quick, because I played this, at least this episode, once. So yeah, this game's pretty freaking awesome. And this is the only possible way I think to record this, so... So this is the uh, guy they offended on, not, not this person. <clears throat> the guy screaming in the background. This guy. Buzz. <laughs> Dude, I'm guilty. Tell him I'm, I'm guilty. Give me the death sentence. I ain't afraid to die. What, what's wrong, Larry? Oh, it's all over. I'm finished. Finished. I can't live in a world without her. I can't. Who? Who took away from me, Nick? Who did this? Probably the uh, guy we saw in the very beginning of the game. It's probably him. You, you never know. I mean, we, we did see him say, quote unquote, I need someone to pin this on. He's like, him. And if he starts looking at Buzz, he's like, he did it. All right, so this is our best friend. When something smells, it's usually butts, but butts. Uh, I get it now. Holy crap, that's I thought it was buzz. It's not buzz. It's butts. You're here, folks, right from the, uh, right from Dumpster Man. Butts stink. Apparently. Blah, 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 blah. Turn. The court is now assessing the trial for Mr. Larry Butts. And that's me, Phoenix. All sexy and handsome. Mm. <clears throat> The client, the charges, it's a mistake, but you know, control yourself. Thanks. Thank you, Honor. Here they're given in the circumstances. You should test your responsibilities. Yes, Your Honor. Hands shaking, eyesight fading. Arms are weak, palms are sweaty, mouth spaghetti. Larry. Thank you. I got it right. Yeah. <coughs> she's she's yelling at me. <clears throat> it's 
So that's the cool thing about it. Sydney's Autopsy. Sydney Stone. That's her name. Boom. Look at that. Like a pro. We looked at a piece of paper to have the answer, and we got it right. Woo! Uh, she died because of hit with a blunt object. I already know that. Okay. So this game is very odd. It's very quirky. Let me tell you something. It's fun. When you get it right, and you're fighting on it, and you're going on it, and it's just fun. So yeah. So this is the thing the person to play with. Spoiler alert. It's a clock as well. You hit, hit it. You, you tap its head, and it says, I think it's whatever time. It's a thinker. Yeah. A famous statue where the guy is always thinking that that's what that is. Okay. Excuse me, I want to check my court records. <laughs> right in the middle of uh, you guys talking, not even paying attention. I'll pay attention. I'll miss any information. This might help your client's case. <laughs> so be ready. Let's hope he doesn't say anything unfortunate. Uh oh, Larry gets excited easily. This could be bad. Yeah, it could. All right, Larry. You and your uh, your your freaking chin strap. So you dumped me. Hey, we fucked you, buddy. We were great together. A Romeo and Juliet. He <laughs> had and Mark here for now. Um, did they all die? <laughs> yes, they did. Looking good. Sound 
And it's the bad guy. His name is Pain. I'm gonna put him in some real pain. This guy. He's always so happy and just holding his hand. He looks like a creepy reversion of the happy salesman. Mask salesman from uh, Zelda. Let's see. Alright. So, what you have to do here is you have to go screen by screen of what he says. And try to see if you can point evidence towards it. I was going door to door selling subscriptions when I saw a man fleeing an apartment. <clears throat> I thought he must be in a hurry because he left the door half open behind him. Thinking it strange, I looked inside the apartment. And then I saw her lying, a woman, not moving, dead. I qualified. I quailed. Yeah. Quailed in fright and found myself unable to go inside. I thought to call the police immediately. The phone in the apartment wasn't working. Went to a nearby park and found a public phone. I remember the time exactly. It was 1 p.m. Wrong. So, the police report says nothing different. Okay. So I'm gonna look at that in a second. So this is the point. Cross examination. Yeah, I know cross examination, woman. Shut up. I ain't stupid. I know. I mean you. Just pretty much what I just said. You go over the evidence, and you go over the testimony, what they're saying, either it's truth or lies, and you go the truths with the lies with the evidence. Cross-examination. It's not the best way to describe it, but it's pretty much, hey, you said the power was out at two. Phones weren't working. The power went out at three. This is what the evidence says. That's just a general... Okay. So, look at this. Exactly, if you miss the stone building, was out from noon, which is 12, to 6 p.m. on the day of the train. Okay. Okay, so this is where I did that to show you. Mm. 
three, two. Ah, she was reported for going to five down. That. So the day from noon to six. You can't. It's just not like it. From one to six, the power is off. Tape program wouldn't work. Okay. And if that just goes on this, we'll just go with that. Ha <laughs> got him. So we're getting the meat and bones of this uh, this bean soup here. So actually, I didn't hear the time. I saw it. There was a tablecloth in the apartment, wasn't there? Yeah, the murder weapon used to kill the victim. It must have been what I saw. A clock? I guess that would explain it. So, the clock, huh? I'm going to show you the clock. I saw it. There's a clock on the table in the apartment. Wasn't there? There's another weapon used to kill the victim. And that's what I saw. So, I've got four strings. Prison. Is 
that. Okay, shit. <clears throat> there we go. Guys, what do you think of this episode? Pretty exciting, huh? I think so. I haven't played this game in a long time. It's... Oh, here we go. Mr. Objection. Very the meaning of this. This is all the head must have come through. Besides, just look at the witness's face. He's shaking. Okay, so that way. Did you start the victim with the clock? No, uh, not there. I never look the fuck no fuck. Okay. Order in the court. The dumpster man court. Guys, I haven't had this much fun in a while. Oh, yeah. Oh,
Yeah, that's right. Um, Ah! Oh. There we go. Good. Thirty minutes of video. Took me thirty minutes to do this one more thing. That was actually fun. Not guilty. Look at that. There you go. So guys, what do you think of this game? Do you think we should play more of it? If we hit... Oh, I don't know. Let's, let's see. How many likes do we need to get this to go another round? Hmm. I'd say a hundred. A hundred or... No. Uh, let's go low. Let's go with 30 likes. If you can send this to all your friends and you enjoyed this video just as much as I did making it, send it to your friends... Get get twenty likes or twenty views or more than that. You know, twenty likes, twenty views, or you know, I'm I'm just asking for a favor because this I've actually had a lot of fun. I probably might just do a video in general, but thanks so much for watching, guys. We will pick back where we left off, and you uh, you guys uh, have a good day because I know I did. This has been Dumpster Run Let's Play. God bless you all, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.